Welcome everybody, Jason, Rip City Cards. How are you doing tonight? We're going to be doing the last box that we have currently of the 2014 75th Anniversary Panini Hall of Fame Baseball Product. If I wasn't all ma already married, I would probably propose to this stuff. I like it that much. Let's see what's going on. I don't know. I mean, we got that in like, a, you know, a couple of uh, weeks ago. I mean, it hasn't been hasn't been that long. Two on card autos of Hall of Fame players, and then it, it just depends. I mean, usually a half dozen uh, numbered inserts. Somewhere, somewhere around there. Ninety percent on card. There are cut autos. See what we got. You're gonna get it all back on the March Madness, Paul. All back on the March Madness. Well, no. I mean, I just, like, I wanted all the autos on the bottom. Like, so that's the last thing. And, I like, some sometimes I kind of have to feel for where exactly they are. It's not. Let's start off with Crusades, Jim Palmer. Yeah, Paul, there's not, like, any, like, one team that's, like, dominating. Like, it's, it's going, like, back and forth so much. I don't know. Miller Huggins. Elite Series. Frank Chance. Elite Dominator. Sixty one out of seventy five. Christy Mathewson. Three out of seventy five. Bill Terry. eBay one oh one. One out of fifty, Casey Stengel. Ten out of twenty five, die cut crusades, orange and gold, Larry Doby. Eight out of fifty Diamond Kings for a Richie Ashburn. I didn't even know there was a debate. Catfish Hunter, Diamond Kings. Carlton Fisk, 74 out of 75. Uh, Hall of Fame Signatures Redemption for Bruce Sutter. Nine 
numbered 51 out of 69 Hall of Fame heroes Johnny Mize original 1983 Don Russ card auto See, I can't tell, like, it looks like a little, like, I see a little, like, curve on it. It's like he doesn't cross over, and it's, like, a little bit round, but you're right, it probably is 64. So 51 out of 64. It is the original All right, five left. 83 Donruss. Right, right, RDC, it's a very cool card. I, th you know, I've seen just a handful of these in them. That's it. Come on, dude. I think it's worth more than that. I think the auction was probably rough. You just gotta Put it up there for like a hundred dollars and let it marinate until some huge Johnny Mize fan comes around, or perhaps Johnny Mize dies. When did they get this sign then? They just had that hanging around?